now let's talk about stones what are stones stones or rocks are hard solid non metallic mineral matter in nature let's see the properties of stone as per construction first structure texture density appearance strength hardness porosity and absorption weathering toughness resistance to fire types of rocks on the basis of their formation rocks are broadly divided into three types first is igneous rock sedimentary rock and metamorphic rock this is a igneous rock let's see how igneous rocks are formed <clears throat> igneous rocks are formed from magma magma is a molten material found deep inside the earth crust this molten magma comes upwards or even erupts from a volcano in the form of lava lava leads to the formation of igneous rock when it is cooled pumic and granite are the example of igneous rock let's talk about granite granite is a light colored igneous rock with grains large enough to be visible with the unaided eye it is formed from the slow crystallization of magma below the earth surface granite is the best igneous rock till known some of the places where granite stone are used are staircase floor tiles and benches now to another type of rock which is sedimentary rock Let's see a small video on how sedimentary rocks are formed. <laughs> Natural processes like rain, wind, flowing rivers sometimes carry small particles of soil, sand, and also dead plants over time sand soil dead plants and some other particles get deposited on top of each other forming a layer and this layer is called layer of sediments over time the layer of sediments press over each other to form a hard substance called sedimentary rock this rock take thousands of years to form sandstone coal and limestone are some example of sedimentary rock. For now, let us focus on sandstone. Sandstone are porous and can be penetrated by water very easily. Brown, red, purple, and pink colored stone are commonly termed as brown stone. Typical uses of sandstone: Sandstone are used in urban raw houses, commercial building, and churches, which were built from 1840s throughout early 20th century. Sandstone are commonly found in northeastern and mid Atlantic area of US. Sandstone are commonly used in stone masonry, paving and benches. Some construction example by sandstone is Stanford University and a house in Mandore. जो
Now moving on to third type of rock, metamorphic rock. As discussed earlier, these are sedimentary rocks. When heat is subjected to sedimentary rocks from earth crust and pressure from the upper layers. Over a period of time, it creates a new type of rock which is called metamorphic rock. For an instance, let's take a look at limestone, which is an example of sedimentary rock. When limestone is subjected to pressure and heat, it produces a different type of stone with different texture and properties. This is commonly called as marble and it is a type of metamorphic rock. Let us now learn about marbles. Marble is a metamorphic rock composed of recrystallized carbonate mineral, most commonly called calcalite or dolomite. Marble may also be folated. Uses of marble Marble is commonly used for sculpture and as a building material. By the physical property of marble, it is soft and can be carved easily. It has a relative resistance to scattering. Marble also contains calcalite which allows light to penetrate marble into several millimeters and it gives a waxy look which adds life to these marble sculptures. Marble are used in floor as a tile. It is used to make sculptures. The most famous building, one of the seven wonders, Taj Mahal, is also made of marble. Quartzite and slate are another example of metamorphic rocks.